How are you? Hello, hello. How are you doing? Good, good, good. Uh, what language do you prefer? Uh, your native language? Well, I'm from Slovakia, so obviously my, my native language is Slovakia, but I... Slovakia? That's a one of the difficult languages. Well, it is, yeah. Well, but I speak Czech, Polish, English, and English. Slovak, Slovakia. Is that is that several uh, during the Second World War? Is a German somewhere in there? Some German town in Slovakia? No, we were we were we were, we were allies of Germany during the World War. Yes. Well, there is a there is a there is a town of the German town there back in the day. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, everyone, everyone, you know, like, like, you know, you can say you're a Viking back in the day, and I used to be a cannibal back in the day too. <laughs> no, 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 the tribal language, you know, the tribal, the tribal, tribal. Yeah. So how old are you? I remember, I remember, I remember talking to a friend from was it Borneo? No. Yeah, was I think was from Borneo. Yeah. Tell me the name of the band. Dayak, they Dayak people. Dayak, Dayak. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and because because back in the day there was a movie. Maybe you remember Sandokan. Sandokan. Is that with uh, what his name? Ah, uh, it's about the uh, it's about the about the American uh oh English Marines. British Marine. This. That was about the Malay pirate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I say. I think I know what you're talking about with the long house. Yeah, and and obviously and the. Nick Nolte. Nick Nolte. No, 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 no. We're talking 1970s, so it's way way before. Ah, not that long then. Oh, I don't know that one. Ah, uh, no cannibal. They are head hunter. Head hunter. It's a different. It's a different term. Head hunter. If you come from North Sumatra, where I come from, I'm a Batak tribe. I'm a belong to the Batak tribe. Uh, -huh. uh I don't know if you know much about geology. Is uh, this the largest uh, eruption ever happened in the history? Is in the Lake Lake Toba. North Sumatra. Uh -huh. uh, so we are between Malaysia here, Borneo there, and then we are in between. Sumatra is the second largest uh -huh. island. Yeah. So. Not, not, I, don't, I don't, don't know much about geography because obviously Indonesia is big. So. Well, I made over there back in. Sorry? Yeah, well, just, just learning the stuff, you know. So. Yeah, well, learning is good, you know what I mean? Always good if you learn something, you know. So how old are you? Yeah. Hmm? How old? I'm 45. 45. 45. Are oh, you younger than me then? Yeah. How, how old are you? I'm almost 50 this year. 50? Not yet. 49. 49. Oh, no, 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 not much older than me. Not much. <laughs> Yeah, but at least about five years older, you know. Now, this, this is my topic. This is what I'm going to say, eh? How funny music can unite people. How, how... Absolutely, I would say. Do you understand what I mean? You know, I think, I, yeah, I think that the... Uh, it's going to be a cliche, of course, but they say that the music is a universal language, and I agree with that. Because... What's the name of the band? Uh, uh, Dreamer and, and, and Fighter. Dreamer and Fighter. So must be new band, huh? Heavy metal? Uh, well, pretty new. Pretty, pretty new. They are more like a uh, hard and heavy, heavy metal. Heavy metal, yeah. Hard, yeah. hard rock. They got the female 
Wow. Check out the check out the site the Indonesian site called Cewek Metal C E W E K Cewek or if you German say C E K C E W C E W E K if that's if you if you speak in German yeah because Indonesian yeah Cewek Metal yeah. yeah. Well, <laughs> Oh, do has risk. Another song. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay, 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 listen, listen to this, yeah? Back in the day, I used to listen to the band such as, like, Brujeria, you know, Brujeria? I listened to them, I listened to Ramstein, I don't mind them, I listened to a lot of different music in the whole, you know? But, what I was thinking, when you, when band play, you can't make it as a concept, I reckon. You gotta just play and then say like, yep, yeah, we're gonna play metal. Let's play metal. You know what I mean? So whatever language they sing, whatever language they sing, if they actually write good song, will be sound good. They don't have to sing in English yes. to be good sound. I mean, have a look at Burger Kill back in the day. It's only about four of their song in English. The rest, yeah. and also. The, the, the how do you call it? the English they they use is just fucking funny, my space time you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah my space time. But but what I'm saying is like uh, that is the concept they don't understand. We understand, I mean uh, English is a universal language, but at the same time, they miss out, they missing out, they missing out the whole. The whole reason, the whole reason why we listen to music. I mean, like, to me, if I can connect to the song, I won't listen it. So, like, there, you know what I mean? I can't, you know, like, there is a, a so many Indonesian singer, like, especially the female one, uh, they're singing heavy metal. So heavy metal, obviously you have to sing clean, you know what I mean? Up and down, up and down. But uh, yep. I have a really big problem with them. I can't explain it to you, but you understand what I mean? I got a really big problem because... I will tell you, I will, I will, I will tell you my, my take on that because the, lately I was, I was listening, and this is not going to be metal. I, I also listen to Indonesian pop music. And for example... <laughs> Yes, Angun, Angun, she asked me. Uh, okay, uh, go international is a, such a big thing for Indonesian. For us, the idea about conquering, going going overseas. But what I'm saying is before is that we 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 fell to the the conversation we have in the past. I mean, like to me, being living in here, and I'm very proud of myself. Sometimes it can like a like a kiss ass to me. You know what I mean? Ass kissing. For them to singing in English, because they want to please the other people. But at the same time, if they sing, the the vocal character, the, the singing technique is there. But just you can just tell something not right about the song. You know what I mean? 
270 million people. Yeah. You don't need you don't need to please anybody because you if if you if you make it big in Indonesia. You well, 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 well. If I say if you say this to me, I become a hater. I mean, if I'm the one say that word, I am the hater in here. I say this before. I mean, okay. You remember I told you about the I was complaining about the the working things, yeah. The working. Now, yeah. Now, three years below this, like for the last three years or for the last three three time the band going overseas in Indonesia this band uh unknown you understand what i mean like nobody give a fuck about them in indonesia like i said this before like in indonesia many bands like a six sakubur or you know like you you know like or oh, the band playing before and i wasn't there i would be really angry you understand what i mean but you know because they're legendary because i want to hear them yeah, you know what I mean? I don't want to missing them out. And uh, that is the kind of band I would like to go, I would like to see, to play in Wacken. So I can say to myself, look, look, you got to look at this band. You got to check out this band. They are good. You understand what I mean? That's the whole idea for me. The, the best time when I bring Indonesian band to Australia. Because in my eyes, they got the fucking, the drummer is fucking good. You know, like a death pommet drummer. He was, he was most fit, you know, mossing, most. The whole time, the whole set, the whole drum set. I mean, I'm watching all of this good drummer. I never see anyone that can do that kind of things. The tempo, the beat, everything. You know what I mean? So, that's the reason why I took them tour in Australia. Because I can be proud of it. Because I can show people. Yeah, I, I, I'm, not, I'm not arguing against that. That's, that's completely like a different story. What I, what I, I want to you know, uh, go with that, but you say in like a ask in the sport of, uh, to the West, this, as I say, you, know, you, can be, you can be easily the best band in Indonesia, but that's, um, that's a lot of fans if you're a good band. And you don't need to be like, oh my God, I need to band it, band it to the Western audience. Well, why do you think I'm so pissed off? Because when they're doing this, when they're doing the selection to going to the Wacken one, yeah, we go, we talk about the nationalism in here because Indonesian is a very nationalistic. It's a product of the, you know, oh, yeah. yeah. So like the reason why, say like when we playing in the big day out, sun wife before we put Indonesian flag, and that's more than enough. Yeah. All right, like you know. Indonesian people made up the 270 million, uh, I mean, 100 and 100 different tribe. There's Balinese, there's Borneo, there's this, there's that. Now, now, Indonesian, for the last, since our independence, until today, we are the truly, truly multicultural. Yeah. We're not like Yugoslavia. Indonesia and Yugoslavia used to be a sister country. You know what I mean? Because the because many religion, many tribes, many culture united as one. Now everybody else collapsed. You notice that now. The only country that survived in the name of the multiculture, multi religion, is only Indonesia. Yeah? Nobody else, no other country that survived. Now I growing up in Bali. Yeah? But I I'm not Balinese. You understand what I mean? Yes. Uh, well, I understand because obviously I know, know uh, a little bit more about Indonesia now. But you got, you, but you, got, you got my dilemma in here. Okay. 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 But check this out again. Check this out again. Check this out. Check this out. When they're doing the final 
from the five band, they're gonna pick one of them. Yeah. They make they make this band follow the rider saying dressing up like a local representation. You know how like some of us wearing the Balinese the headgear like the sarong yeah. and all that shit. Well, imagine that. Four of that band actually dressing up like Borneo one. They put the headhunter music on it. They put their uh what do you call that? They put their special ethnic sound. Yeah. But they not they don't have any album sound like that. Just only for that day. So they can go to Wacken. It's not hard. It's not hard. It's not hard. Like I said before, in Bali, it's not just Balinese living in there. So what I'm saying is, they we are different people, different tribe. So what I'm saying is, what we doing there, we dressing up like someone not us. That's what happening. Yeah. Uh, you know, for uh, an average fan going to Wacken, which I'm not going because I've never been to Wacken, no, so I'm going. Yeah, to, I'm not interested. They, they simply don't. They, they simply don't know that. Yeah, but. Because, uh, that's, 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 that's the issue for you because obviously you know the difference, whatever you know. But but for for the, for the, for people who are not invested there that have it in the Indonesian scene, they will simply have no idea. Oh yeah, I know that. Don't you worry about that. But my point is in here. I listen to all kind of music, like what, like you, you are, like what you sang before. I listen to everything. But at the same time, I don't believe in any religion. I'm a atheist myself. It's some something really hard to swallow for Indonesian when they know when I say I don't believe in God. Oh, I can become a. I could become some. What do you call that? Sacrilegious, you know what I mean? But, yeah. yeah, to me, music is like a religion to me. Especially metal. Yeah? yeah. So what they're doing in there, to me, because Indonesian is very Puritan, yeah? Indonesian people, they won't buy T-shirt, the bootleg, they won't buy that. That's embarrassing for them to buy them. You know that? They won't buy bootleg CD. They won't buy bootleg merchandise. They living poor, but they will order merchandise from overseas. Just to keep there. If you see someone posting something, they say Ori. O-R-I is the meaning original. Yeah. The big thing about that in Indonesia. Yeah? About the originality. Yeah. Now, metal is not much left. I mean, like. Everything is money, obviously. You know, we're selling our testicle from for fucking money. You know what I mean? But my point is, is uh, what they say? What Jamie Justa say from a hate, hate breed? You got nothing. What they say? Something. Or if you not live for something, and you will die for nothing. And to me, to me. To me personally, I'm not enforcing it to anyone. With what I believe, with the music thing, what they're doing in there is pretty fucking stupid. It's lying, it's deceiving, and it's dictating. The band, one band, five personal, five people in one band, they're all probably different tribe. It doesn't make sense if they have to wearing something. And for Indonesian, it's very sacred. Say, I come from North Sumatra myself. The band play from North Sumatra, their name Jin. They were standing on the stage, carry one of our ancestral stick. Our, you know what I mean? If you know, if he know, if he actually spend a little bit more time 
to understand what's the meaning of that thing that he hold, he won't even touch it. You know how the Japanese, a Japanese uh, samurai, they respect their katana with the, like a soul? Yeah. What's similar? You understand what I mean? So for us, like for this guy, yeah. it's sacrilegious. Exactly. Exactly. Well, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. They overkill. Just to pleasing these people in Wacken. They overkill. They're doing stupid shit. And when other people doesn't give a fuck what they're doing. Well, it's actually... I know, but it's actually... It's a reminder for us to the future... For the next year, they won't do it anymore. Because I'm not the only one have a word about this. One of the band in that things, they don't want to fucking do it. And and lots of band in Indonesia make a big complaining about it in the social media. But Indonesian people is very polite. They're not going to speak to you. They're not going to even put it on the post. They're not going to posting it. But sarcastically, we mention about it. Me, I'm me myself. I'm Australian. I mean, I'm I'm born in Indonesia. I'm still Indonesian, but my personality, I'm a larrikan like Australian. I'm loud. I'm I'm a metalhead. I doing like I'm 15 years old. You know what I mean? 15 years old uh, metal kid. So I want fucking you know I want fucking quiet about it. I will, I will screaming loud about it. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, it's like the joke, like this. Oh, something exciting about it, I reckon. You know what I mean? I mean, if we don't talk about this, no one's gonna talk about it, and that thing's gonna become boring. I mean. Come on, man. How many band playing music in this world? You know what I mean? I understand for them yeah. back to be different. But at the same time, when I bring uh, that permit to Australia, and Burger Kill, the quality itself speaks for it. That's true. You, you can't deny that. You know what I mean? They, because they are a good band. They sounds good. They're playing metal. They're not they don't dressing up like monkey. Or they're not dressing up like a fucking... You know what I mean? That's not the meaning that topping monyet. Topping monyet is... Uh, did you check the topping monyet? Well, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I explain to you. In Indonesia, people like are making a entertaining kids. But you pay this guy entertaining here. Yeah. It's like playing people... Like people yeah. playing... Uh, ba uh, basker, basker, yeah. You know that, like people play guitar or or yeah. singing on the street. Yeah. Well, these people did. Yeah. They bring monkey. Yeah. Oh yeah. No. Uh, they will be trying this monkey, and they will play some specific music, and this monkey will go on the push bike, like a mini push bike. But that, you know, or oh oh, the monkey today is gonna play as Madonna, and then and the monkey will pick up umbrella and acting like a girl. You know what I mean? That kind of things. Oh I'm not kidding. You check them out. It's called it's called packing a uh, topping monyet because the monkey wearing a mask. Topping is a mask, yeah. yeah? But that's Indonesia. It's a very cruel. It's a very cruel thing. That's why I'm using that term, and everyone laugh about it and agree with me without saying anything. I know they agree because topping monyet. These people like they well. It's like a circus, basically. It is circus. Makes sense? But individual. Yeah, I, yeah, I, see, I see your point, absolutely. That's what they did in Indonesia. Like, one person will be carrying the things, and he will start playing music, or hitting the drum, or hit, using a fucking, what do you call that one? A noise. And this monkey will just talk many crazy shit. If you actually, if you can Google them up, check them out in the YouTube, you will love your ass of mine. Because it's a funny shit. That is my point. 
So in the recent term, listen to this, this is what I tell them. I say to them, yeah, I'm gonna go soon here too. I say to them, oh, uh, this thing, when when they talk about the five band gonna be on the stage, in my mind, my expectation, I thought I'm going to watching a cockfight. Because cockfight, they're killing each other. And when I'm watching it, I just realize it. It's only topping money yet. Oh, yeah. Make sense now? Yeah, me too. I need to go for now, it's, uh, but, but I have to say it was very, it was great to talk to you. Like Thank you very much, yeah. Like on the video. Yeah, I will put this on, there on my YouTube and I will share you the links. You, you can. Yeah, oh yeah, you are right, you look handsome in there. Uh, we, we, we <laughs> Thank you very much. I still look handsome, but baldy. Uh, what do you say? In Indonesia we say Sampai Jumpa. What do you say in your language? Yeah. What the fuck? What they say? Ligi masa. Ligi masa. All right. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was as my. Chit chat and this guy I have talk a lot with in Instagram. Oh hang on in the Facebook actually. So there you go. I just talk about something relevant about how people go to Wacken and they have to dress up somebody who they know. So I'm really appreciate your people time to watching this and if you wanna hear more or you have a band that you want me to review please let me know I will be more than happy to do it oh you just only see my ball head but anyway thank you very much guys Sampai Jumpa Please like, share and subscribe.